As we focus on Puna, we are now hearing about the other areas on the Big Island that also felt the wrath of Tropical Storm Isel. The Edmund C. Olson Trust owns agriculture property throughout the state, but says its macadamia and coffee farms in Ka'u felt the hit. These are just some of the Ka'u casualties from Tropical Storm Isel. Norfolk pine trees twisted by the winds. Macadamia nut trees pulled out of the ground, some literally split in half. Edmund C. Olson Trust land manager John Cross says the rain loosened the soil, then the wind roared in. Wind came down off of Mauna Loa through the Wood Valley area and laid down quite a bit of these young trees. Um, so that was pretty hard on us. We're out there trying to stand up some and then remove the ones that have just been completely destroyed. Cross says they're estimating a cell caused about a half a million dollars in losses to their macadamia crop. We, you know, lost quite a bit of trees. We lost uh, over 2,000 macadamia trees. They're all of fairly young age, about eight to nine years of age. And um, that's very, you know, a bad time in, in their life to have a windstorm come through because. The trees have a big, large canopy on them, and they don't have a fully mature root system. The trust also suffered damage to its coffee plants. The rain and wind destroyed about 1,500 coffee plants, including two to 300 that were fully matured and bearing fruit. Now, Cross says there was also a flash flood over Wood Valley Road that took out some of the road pavement in that area.